I think this is one of the most worth uh, projects that uh, USIU will ever undertake with the organizations that it will be collaborating with. Because essentially, if you look at the landscape, what is happening in the country, everybody seems to be focused on what politicians want and what the adults want. But then ideally, nobody is thinking about what the children want. And so this project seeks to give children uh, a voice under CRC Article 12. Give me one reason to stay here And I'll turn right back around Emmanuel Rukundo, if I could be the president for five minutes, I could help those people in Turkana. If I were the president, I would have first given priority to the orphans and the widows and those who are disabled. Because as you see in our country, the, the orphans and the widows and the disabled are not given much priority. My name is Faith Wanjiro. If I could be a president for five minutes, I could let there be peace. The IDPs will be back and replaced where they are and there could be harmony in, in the country and everybody could, could have a, an opportunity to get a job and provide himself with food and shelter. Children have this amazing ability to see the things that we don't see. They have a, a knack to bring our focus back to the things that are most important. When we give them this opportunity, it'll expose a part of us that we have forgotten because we are so focused on, on politics, on fighting for resources, on being number one. But what they want is what's best for everyone, and that's exactly what we're supposed to be fighting for. Hearing their voice will bring our focus back to that. My name is John Mike Baki. If I am, I could, I, I could be a president. I could make my country to have peace. Make sure there is, there is no fight. I make sure there is food. My name is Joe Wangeshi. Uh, if I could be given that opportunity of being a president for five minutes, I would make sure uh, that I ban the the dealing of the drugs, any drug misuse that is in, in Kenya. My name is Ivan Munde, and if I was the president for Kenya, I would have constructed the roads. If you look at Narok now, it doesn't have good roads. I would look for good ministers who can take care of Kenya. And I would also increase institutions for children to learn, to make Kenya a better place to live. Also, also like to be the first woman who is a president in Kenya, and I will make women leaders of this great country. Thank you. 